conditional actions. Using this model, you can automate some actions in the database. When you enter certain data into the form, you can send email and SMS notifications, update the record, show messages, and redirect user to web pages. These actions can be used and combined with each other at the same time. In this video, we will look at all conditional actions usage examples. First, go to the Form Builder menu and open the Actions tab. To create a conditional action, you need to Choose criteria using the similar to search form on QuintaDB Enter the name Choose when to perform an action. It can be done when form submitted and when record updated. You can also activate the option Do not submit data to table if criteria matches. I'll talk about this option near to the video ending. Select which action to perform. First, I will show the email notification action. We have a database with orders, and it's necessary to send notification to the client when the order state is updating. When you created an action, you can change the settings. To do this, click on the Edit button. Here, you can configure the email or SMS notification template. Click on the Edit button. On the next page, you need to specify the recipients. You can enter the email manually, one per line, or select the email field, which contains the address. Be sure to indicate the subject and letter's body. Also, you can get the record's values using HTML field names, which you can get from the drop-down list below. Now, when you update the order status, the client will receive a notification letter. SMS notifications work similarly. Consider the action Update record when form submitted. For this example, we use the warehouse database. Let's create the following criteria. If the engine part manufacture date is before January 1st, 2015, you can add additional criteria using this link. And manufacturer by 10 trucks. Next, you need to edit the update record action. If all criteria are matched, then the discontinued status for these parts will be set. Using the plus icon, you can add recording columns to be updated. For example, set the value to the withdrawn and dispose field. If you want to show predefined message depending from the user's choice on form, you need to configure the criteria and message template. For example, we can use the name field. Thus, the user will see the message Thank you, username, for your order. Redirect user to another web page. For example, you can redirect user to the Apple page if he order Apple device. Let's go back to the do not submit data to table if criteria matches option. If you enable this option, the service will not allow to send data to your database if criteria match. For example, the user needs to enter the date range on this form, vacation start date and vacation end date, 
you can configure criteria specifies the date range. The date will not be sent. You can also create a show message action to display it to user. I am sure that you can find many uses for this model in your project. Subscribe and stay tuned on thequintadb.com.